Coming up on our next yeah, interview episode, was Dennis was Wood Mapco of Terraflex, Terraflex.com. You know, it was Mepco, then it turned into Terraflex. Oh my God, that's such a better, that's such a better yeah. name than Mepco. <laughs> yeah, well, Military Equipment and Parts Company. Well, military that's what sounds that good. was. Yeah. So they, well, yeah, they, they sold, you know, it was the Willys days. I mean, you were talking 50, whatever, 55, 56 years ago. So it was back in the old school stuff. So they'd sell old war surplus stuff. And and then, yeah, over the years, it, it, it you know, evolved into a, a full on Jeep store uh, with Mepco. But then when the when the Wrangler came out, um, uh, the TJ, actually, not just the Wrangler, but the TJ, there was there was no there weren't any coil spring lifts out there. I can so, see that because the the YJ uh, Mepco, didn't it was all all leaf springs yeah, and then the yeah. coils to the TJ that makes sense. Yeah, so so Mepco was was selling all the different lifts out there. You know, they're just a parts store, and uh, they said, "Well, shoot, let's why don't we just make a, a coil spring lift?" So they went after it and uh, got some springs and da da da. You know, whole thing happened and it was kind of crazy. They they built built this lift and. Uh, uh, put it on a TJ and it was, you know, it was cool and it worked and all that, but they had, it was, it was Mepco. They were a parts store. They weren't a manufacturer. So they had really had no outlet for, uh, any kind of a, a way to show the thing and to present it. But, uh, they were a, a big best top dealer back in the day. You're my friend. You're my new friend. <laughs>